All across the Portland metro area, a wild combination of weather, rainbows and lightning. All at once, the storms rotated above in a stormy dark stew. <laughs> wow. It unleashed big hail in Park Rose Heights and Maywood Park, just to name a few spots. And it appears lightning struck this tree in Vancouver as well. And I parked the car and, and uh, looked and I went, oh my, this is something happened here. But nowhere did we find more concentrated damage than just off Gleason in the area of Northeast 63rd. At least a half dozen neighbors had trees blown down or branches ripped off by strong winds. Limbs from a big tree took out Ron Martin's hawthorn berry tree. He saw it happen, checking the weather from his front porch. And then the wind just came up within seconds and it just blew the tree over and then it was gone. It was crazy. And around the corner, the most severe damage, big tree branches strewn everywhere. We saw it from the beginning to the end. The clouds got really dark. Nina Smith was home with her mom and baby, and the home surveillance cameras were rolling. And no sooner did we turn around and start looking at the cameras, and there was just wind and branches and all of it coming towards our house. It was scary. My adrenaline started rushing. I'm like grabbing my baby. My mom's yelling, get away from the windows. And I'm just like, what do we do? What do you do in that moment? It was over like that. And when they went outside, man, was there a lot. I was like, my car, mom's car. We walked towards mom's a little bit more and we're like, oh, mom's car. A fast moving storm they'll never, ever forget. Well, the National Weather Service came out and surveyed this area, say there was no tornado. But I guess this is proof it doesn't take one to do some damage. Maggie, back to you.